In this video, we'll balance the chemical equation for Na plus Cl2 yields NaCl. This is sodium plus chlorine gas, and it's giving us sodium chloride. The first thing we need to do is to count up the number of atoms. So there's a one after here. We don't write it, but it's there. It's assumed to be there. So we have one sodium atom, the subscript here, two chlorine atoms. Then on the product side, one sodium and one chlorine. So we've counted everything up. Now we can balance the equation. The only thing we can change are the numbers in front. These are called the coefficients. Right now, they're ones. We don't write it, but they're assumed to be one. We can't change these subscripts, these numbers after. Those we can't change. So I have two chlorine atoms here, and the product's one. I'm going to put a coefficient of two in front of the NaCl. This two applies to everything. So I have one times two. Now I have two sodium atoms. One times the two. That gives me two chlorine atoms. So I balance the chlorine atoms. Now the sodium atoms, they aren't quite right. That's pretty easy to fix, though. If I put a coefficient of 2 in front of the Na, 1 times 2, that'll give us two sodium atoms. So they're the same. The chlorines, those are the same. And we're done. This equation is balanced. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for Na plus Cl2 yields NaCl. Sodium plus chlorine gas gives us sodium chloride. Thanks for watching.